Well, howdy y'all. Handy Redneck here. It's the uh, 6th of June, 2022, and uh, I'm going to show you how I set up my uh, Hova baiters and little giant incubators. Uh, I'm setting this one up to run without an automatic turner in it. Uh, this is actually a Hova baiter, but uh, uh, as you can see, we've got down in the bottom with the... Um, channels here with water and then uh, a quarter inch by quarter inch screen on top of that we're going to put some uh, um, shelf liner that's foamy and spongy uh, in the middle here since this is the hova baiter uh, we're going to put uh, our calibrated govi sensor you know we're just going to set this in here and then we're going to do something that a lot of people are going to think I'm a little bit crazy for. But believe me, it actually is a good thing. We're going to add some fake eggs. And the reason we're adding these fake eggs is they are a heat sink. And uh, they will actually absorb heat and radiate it back out. And that will actually help to stabilize the temperature in the incubator. Now again, everything's going to the center here for now because this is a hovabator and the hovabator's heating element runs along out here. Now, uh, as I was saying, this here's the hovabator. And as you can see, the heating element runs around the outside here not in the center. Uh, unlike the little giant, the little giant's heating element is just right in here. But we don't, we don't really care about that right now. So we got all that set and we're going to put our hovabator lid on. And uh, the hovabator has two windows. Uh, they're smaller than the little giant windows, but they do the same function. Uh, where I live, I just leave the plugs out because uh, it don't matter much here. And then uh, we've got uh, an increase and de decrease setting. And we're just going to turn this ar around so our cable is uh, at this side, away from the wall, so we can plug it in. And then, then this is an... Uh, heat on indicator light now to make adjustments to the hova baiters you've got the, a little knob here to increase and lock or unlock and decrease and that's so you can make fine adjustments um, again with the fake eggs inside you shouldn't have to adjust this uh, as often or if ever, once you get it set, because those eggs inside will actually help to prolong the life of your uh, heating element because again, they absorb and then radiate the heat so your heating element won't have to work as hard. Anyway, this here's been a handy redneck. I'll talk to y'all later.